In LabScribe, here's a metabolic trace that had been recorded. To analyze the data, click the Analyze button. In the window that comes up, make sure the CO2 channel is set to the CO2 concentration, O2 to the O2 concentration, volume channel to expired air, and change your heart rate channel to the heart rate. You can set an energy and a respiratory rate channel if you have those as well. Under the Settings tab, you can put the individual's name, the protocol, their age, their sex, how often we want to calculate, their height and weight, a maximum heart rate, inspiratory O2 and CO2, as well as a blood pressure. We can save a subject, but we can also load one. Let's do so. Locate it on your disk. It'll be an IWX SUB file. Hit open. It fills in the information for us. Going over to zones, we can set various zones for color coding. We can customize a graph and we can generate a report. Going back to settings, move the bottom section up a little bit and now hit calculate. There's the graph on the right and the values below color coded with the zones. Going to the bottom here, here's our max VO2, here's our RER, and here's our METS calculation. We can copy all the data. We can export it out as an Excel file. We have a choice of numbers of graphs that we can copy and put into a report. But easier, let's just go up to the Report tab. You can add a logo, create the report, and even add those particular items you'd like included in that report. But what it does, it assembles all the various portions of it. So here's the patient information, the test protocol, the environment, the zones that we had set up, the results, the normative data based on Haywood, and then all the various graphs. Being an HTML file, it can be opened up in a word processor and the discussion of the findings can be completed.